Hey guys, welcome to our Learning to Excel channel. Today we're going to be looking at the protect sheet function in Excel while only locking certain cells. So here we've got an international sales table and if we want to present this table to our colleagues but we don't want them to edit anything in the table but we do want them to be able to leave a note here in this note column one way to do that is to lock all the cells in this sheet and then unlock the cells in this note column. So how we do that is by selecting all the cells in the sheet, right click, then select format cells, and in this format cells pop-up window we can see in the protection tab all cells are locked. So perfect, that's a good starting point. So click OK, and now we want to go over to the note column and unlock the cells in the note column. So that's cell Q4 to Q703. And then we right click on this selection, again go to Format Cells, and then in the Protection tab of the Format Cells pop up window, we deselect the locked checkbox. We then press OK, and we've now unlocked all the cells in the note column. So now we can protect the sheet. So let's go to the review tab and the protect group and then go protect sheet. We get this pop-up window where we're prompted for a uh, password. Let's put that in and then make sure this checkbox is selected. So this protects the lock cells. And then down below here in the selection panel, we can dictate what we want users to be able to do in the sheet. So we just want them to be able to select locked and unlocked cells, no formatting, no inserting, deleting, sorting, filtering, whatever. So we're happy with that, so press OK. And then we've got to re-enter our password. Click OK again. And now if we try and edit anywhere in the sheet that's locked, we get that pop-up. So we can't do anything to the sheet if the cell is locked. We get this pop-up saying that the sheet is protected and we have to unprotect it. But if we go over here to the note column, and let's say I want to leave a note in row nine, let's say the sale didn't go through, we can do that because this column is unprotected. It's, the cells are unlocked, so the column is unprotected, and we can leave whatever note we want. So sale under review here, can leave that note as well, and so on. So, that's the protect sheet function in Excel while locking certain cells. I hope it was a helpful video. If you'd like to see more videos like this, or if you're struggling with Excel, or you have your own Excel problems or queries that you'd like help with, please subscribe to our channel and you can reach out to our team and we'll help you. Thanks for watching. Have a great day.